Welcome to Self-Awareness Tools and Techniques at SelfImproveHub.com. In Module 2 of our journey, we focus not just on learning, but on transforming. Imagine embarking on a quest to uncover the deepest aspects of yourself. Ready to begin this exciting adventure? Let's dive in. Remember, these practices are designed to be flexible. You can choose which practices to focus on based on your personal growth needs. The most important aspect is to engage with them regularly and reflect on your experiences. Our first practice in self-awareness is self-reflection. This is practice number one. Self-reflection acts like a mirror to your soul, prompting you to ask meaningful questions for deeper insights into your thoughts and feelings. It's crucial because it illuminates the areas of your life where you excel and those needing improvement. For example, at the end of each day, ask yourself, what did I learn today? And how did I contribute to my values? Now, pause the video. Take some time to write down three things you did well today and three areas for improvement. Reflect on what these reveal about you and then resume the video. Welcome back. Great job on completing the first practice. Remember, each step you take on this journey of self-reflection is valuable for personal growth. Moving on to practice number two, gathering constructive feedback. Feedback is a crucial aspect of self-awareness, providing perspectives beyond your own. Seek feedback from friends, family, or colleagues. Please pause the video, create a feedback form, and share it with three people. After you've gathered and reflected on this feedback, resume the video. Welcome back, and well done. Understanding how others view us can significantly enhance our journey to self-awareness. Next, we have practice number three, embracing mindfulness. Mindfulness is about being fully present in the moment, a crucial skill for tuning into your inner voice. Pause the video, set a timer for five minutes, and focus on your breathing. Notice the sensations and thoughts, and then gently bring your focus back to your breath. When you're ready, return to continue. Excellent work! Taking time to be present is a vital skill in your self-awareness toolkit. As we continue, remember that each practice is a stepping stone on your journey. You can choose to do all these practices in a row or select the ones that resonate most with you at this moment. The key is consistency and willingness to engage with each practice. Let's move on to practice number four, journaling. This practice is about having a private conversation with yourself, allowing for inner clarity and reflection. Pause the video and write about a recent challenge and your feelings about it. Resume once you've finished. Now, we'll explore practice number five, personality tests. These tests act as roadmaps to understanding your unique traits. Pause here, complete a personality test online, and then share your insights in a journal entry before resuming the video. Next is practice number six, linking emotions and thoughts. This practice is about understanding how your emotions influence your thoughts and vice versa. Pause the video, identify an emotion you felt strongly today, and trace it back to the thought that caused it. Resume once you're done. Practice number seven, recognizing and reshaping thought patterns. Your thoughts shape your reality, and identifying negative patterns is key to transforming them into positive ones. Pause here, note down your thoughts, work on reframing them positively, and resume when ready. Now, on to practice number eight, developing a growth mindset. This mindset involves viewing challenges as opportunities to improve. 
pause the video, list three recent setbacks, reframe them as growth opportunities, and then resume. Practice number nine involves navigating cognitive biases and distortions. Recognizing these biases is essential for clear thinking. Pause the video, reflect on a recent decision, identify any biases, and then return. In practice number 10, aligning behaviors with values and purpose, ensure your actions reflect your deepest values. Pause, write down your top five values and how your recent actions align with them, then resume. Practice number 11, adapting to different situations. Reflect on how you adapt your communication style in various settings. Pause the video, think of a recent adaptation, journal about it, and then come back. Practice number 12, managing conflicts effectively. Understand both your emotions and others in conflicts. Pause the video, reflect on a recent conflict, analyze your response, and then resume. Practice number 13, self-awareness in leadership. It's about knowing your strengths and weaknesses as a leader. Pause, write down qualities you admire in a leader, compare them to your own and resume. Practice number 14, enhancing communication with self-awareness. Focus on conveying your thoughts and feelings clearly. Pause the video, practice clear and empathetic communication for a week, and then continue. Finally, practice number 15, empathy. Try to fully understand the other person's perspective before responding. Pause the video, have an empathetic conversation, and then resume. In conclusion, this is a continuous path of growth and discovery. Keep these tools handy to navigate the intricate world of your inner self. Your journey to self-awareness is a beautiful one filled with insights and transformations. Embrace it with an open heart and mind. Final exercise, create a personal action plan for continuing your self-awareness journey, including daily practices and long-term goals. As you continue on your journey, remember that self-awareness is the key to personal growth and professional success. It's not just about knowing yourself but about using that knowledge to live a more fulfilling and impactful life.